part of the iconic 80s boy band Brass raced up the charts with this hit when will I be famous 20 years later by the Luke brothers Luke and Matt Goss reunited for a documentary that drove the fans wild didn't it just and now Luke is riding high with a new movie out and another one in the making. Yes, thankfully. Goodness Lovely me. Lovely to see you this morning. Nice yeah, to see you. great to nice see you this yes. morning. Yeah. So it's all going brilliantly. So tell us about the movie that's out, first of all, mm -hmm. that people get to see. Well, it's directed by a dear friend of mine, Ray uh, Zhu, who is a Chinese director. Really talented young man in his 20s. The film that you're also making yeah, with Joan excited. Collins. Joan was, she's an icon. And yes. amazing to work with seven or eight pages yesterday. And she was so on it. And I had to keep my, keep my A game on just to stay with her. She was amazing. So tell us a little bit about this film here as well, because he looks he looks a little bit broken. I'm gonna uh, be honest. You could say that, yeah. He's had probably ten years worth of what we all go through in one day. And the story is clever because it's kind of feasible. And he just is a broken he's heard what he's not for a decade too long. There's not much left of him. And uh, right here he feels somewhat cornered uh, by Jones. <laughs> Uh, attention. <laughs> so, where, so where are the laughs then? What kind of comedy is it? Are you slapstick? No, it's a, it? it's a, it's a, it's kind of a, it's a drama, it's a, a dramedy, I guess. It's, um, it's, I, I play tr very true to character, and then I have these wonderful, talented uh, actors around me that are probably better at comedy than my. Mom. And it's quite tragic. And the laughs will come at different times for different people. We're not searching for the laughs. It's a great story. So Joan Collins, what's she like um, when you're not? She's not on camera. We know her as this. <clears throat> Just extraordinary, grand dame, regal, yeah. grand dame. Well, As she sit there eating chips in between takes. I mean, what? Well, she she's do? extremely elegant, is she? uh, on and off screen. Um, but I, you know what I loved is yesterday I heard her say to somebody, "Don't call me Dame." She's very, she's part of the gang, you know. Yeah. To be on screen with her yesterday was a big buzz for me. So the documentary that mm -hmm. just took everybody by storm. You must feel that it was a great thing to have done because it seems to have shaken things up for you. When are we going to see some more Bross music? Well, yes, it was. A, I'm so happy we did it. When you were in uh, with your brother, we were talking about rumours about doing another documentary. This one had been such a great success, mm -hmm. as you say, and it had been so honest and candid and, and, and enjoyable to watch. Uh, and you were saying that you might be, you were talking about maybe doing another one. Would that follow the new album and the new music and the new tour? Yeah, you know, I think Matt and I are unanimous in that the, uh, the, the, the next film needs to be, we want it to be grittier because the other movie was driven by family and sure. on a backdrop mm. of music, but we want to bring that dynamic the other way around, so music is what's driving the next film. But I think we're both, we're both looking to do that. And we've been asked about biopics and all sorts of, of things. Course, wow. Of course, of course. When the time. screaming starts again. <laughs> That's yeah, what you do need to call I. it. Crispy old guys like me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and you and your brother are still as good as you were when it ended the movie? It's all still strong and happy? And... Well, he's not here today, and I don't know, we would probably do some fake fight in the dressing room again, but, it, <laughs> but he and I are closer than we've ever been. Right. I, I mean, we play same all the time, video games, same as we're... We're brothers again. It's fantastic. Amazing. Well, yeah. look, it's, it's lovely to have you here. Thank you for coming well, thanks in. Thanks for having me. Best of luck with Extracurricular, which came out on Monday, and, of course, with The Lost Adjuster as well. We look forward to seeing Thank that you. when you come.